Season 6 of Where Hawaii Eats is brought to you by the Honolulu Star Advertisers Dining Out, Cisco Hawaii, Outrigger Hotels and Resorts, Hawaii Cancer Care, Royal Lahaina Resort and Bungalows, and Waikiki's Premier Asian Food Hall, Styx Asia. Welcome to Where Hawaii Eats. We are joined again once again with our friend Jason Peel, executive chef and owner of Nami Kazi. Hi, Anne. Hi, how are you? Great. Great um, that you're here. Well, thanks for, um, you know, starting yes. off with a cocktail. So we're going to cheers to our Nami Kaze champagne, champagne cocktail. Champagne our cocktail. bartender, Paul, is doing awesome. We just started our bar program and we're super excited. So we're getting, you know, it takes time. We're, we're building up, ramping up. So the last time we were here, you guys were only suited up for takeout. Mm -hmm. Now you guys are up, running, we have brunch, brunch and we also have dinner, dinner service. Wednesday through Sunday. When, Wednesday through Sunday. Never mind. Wednesday through Sunday. Well, I'm here so you guys can come say hi. <laughs> so this is interesting because this is an omakase that you have so, created. Yeah, part of it. Part of it. Yes. Because so, it's only half of it. Um, uh, about mm, well, a third of it. A third of it. Yeah. So. I really wanted to promote my sushi chefs, Shane and Devin, and um, you know local boys from Oahu, and you know gotta gotta make sure we support the next generation of chefs sure. coming up, and they've been doing great things for a long time, and stuck with me through COVID, and gotta give back. So, what do I try first here? So let's start with the oyster. So this would be one of our first courses. It's an oyster um, with smoked trout roll. Um, our tozazu and a little bit of daikon oroshi. Very simple, but um, these are actually very a newer oyster to Hawaii since the kushis are not uh, available. Am I eating but, this correctly? Oh, you just, just go. Any way you feel like. That's how we do it here. <laughs> no judging. I'm gonna have a look. That's Make really sure good. Tastes. That's delicious. The cocktail is good. I love your little <laughs> flowers here. Those are actually from my house. I grow them at my house. Are you lying? But the rain, yeah, no, I'm not lying. I don't, I don't, ah, come on. Okay. <laughs> oh, but yeah, it's been so rainy, I haven't, they haven't been producing, but. I love, it's so, it's yeah. like the perfect touch. Yeah, well, if really I bought pretty. them, they'd be so expensive. <laughs> Sustainable sure Nami Kaze. Huh? Are you not, are you, are you sure you're not Chinese? Um, I, I did marry into the Hong Kong side, but <laughs> she does beautiful breads and stuff for us, so it's wonderful. So next, we'll go to, um, what are we going to? Sorry. We'll go to our ahi sampler. This is. So this is two. our. This will be probably around four or five, fifth course probably. But so we wanted to just use what's local and um, some things from Japan also and from around the world. So the first one on your right is two total. This one. With our house soy and caviar. Um, so all at one bite. Yeah. One bite. If you want, it's up to you. Like I said. Here in Namikaze, we don't judge. <laughs> we'll give a slight pause for Anne to eat. <laughs> and a little sip for me. So three different versions of ahi. Mm. That, uh... Second one is akame um, with uni. On top of that is lardo from uh, my good friend Bob um, and Mountain View Dairy David Wong, um, his pork. So it's cured Mountain by Bob. Farms, David Wong, we love him. A little bit of ponzu, a little bit of jalapeno, and then like red eye, a common eye. So. Okay. Get in. Down the hat. One more drink for me, too. <laughs> mm. Really good. Mm. Mouthful, huh? <laughs> Where are you from? <laughs> okay, last okay. but not least. Last one. Sorry. Um, this one is an. Um, maguro, so akame also, but this one's marinated in, in um, we do a ahizugi, but a flash marinade. On top of that is small kind farm mushroom XO. Small kind farm. Small kind. Love those guys. Mm -hmm. Hey, you need to work out over there. Mm. Yeah? We gotta have that one with the sake. So, um, we do have a, a house sake on tap, but it's, it's actually really good. I, I like it because one is super accessible for me. <laughs> but also, it's really crisp and clean. So, thank you, Brandon. And this is what you encourage to drink with your 
Some of it. We have a, we have a bunch of sakes on the menu also, but I mean, usually I, I, I want cocktails, so I'm, I'm so happy that Paul's doing a great job with our cocktail program. We're going to take a quick break. Mm. Cheers. And we're going to go to the next course mm -hmm. and learn a little bit more about your menu and what else you have going on here. Sounds good. Welcome back. And we are here with Chef Jason and we are going on course number four. Well, yeah, three. for today. For today, haha. -ha. For <laughs> three. This is our course three for today. But uh, um, yeah, we're, we're still figuring out the exact amount that's going to fulfill without over fulfilling. This would be the next one? So we'll do we'll do the kampachi for next. Well that's what we'll omakase get you all dirty. means, right? Omakase my means. My choice. Chef's not your choice, my not choice. Not my choice, your choice. <laughs> okay. Are we trying to make a good choices? <laughs> We're making good choices Hopefully now. Hopefully good choices. <laughs> so these are uh, from the Big Island Kompachi. Um, it's actually a Korean hot honey, so you should be familiar, it I might, suppose, maybe. I don't know, not might, really. My, uh, um, and a little bit of butternut squash from the Big Island also, with uh, pickled with lemon. So not, not too spicy, you know, but yeah, just have a little taste. A bit, good. A little bit homey? No? From your roots? Korean roots. Yeah? All right. That's what I love. Excellent. <laughs> a little nostalgia. So yeah, no? good. No, 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 no. Very, know. very good. Oh my gosh. That's what you used to eat growing up, right? Just spicy. <laughs> just anything spicy I ate. <laughs> I just joking. You said, give me a jar of Tabasco. I'm good. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> but, um, we'll go on to, so, I usually do rice last. So we'll go on to the chaomushi. So tell me, what, what is this? Chaomushi is a steamed egg custard. Egg um, custard. This one, we made the base with lobster, mm -hmm. and then, because um, we'll have lobster on another course, using the bodies, but this one is with foie gras on top, a little bit of black garlic, brown butter, um, some citrus, so. Um, but very, I like mine really light, so. That's good. Sometimes it, it falls apart if you stir it too much, you know, and then it looks, bad after that. <laughs> Why is but, this always incorporated in omakase? Um, I think for, for me personally, I love chawamushi. So I love the delicateness of it and I love being able to, it's like a, it's like a canvas for other things. So mm -hmm. I like giving my team things that they can build on themselves. Um, so it's an easy, not easy, but it's a good way for them to start off with something as a base and then put their own flavors and techniques on it. So. When you have that many courses, mm. you have to have things that are in there to cleanse your palate. Yeah. So is that kind of what this... Kind of, know? but I, I like... I, you know, so it's a good balance between me and my sushi chefs, um, especially Shane. He likes lighter flavors. Mm -hmm. I, like, I like to hit you in the face. So it, it's a good balance, I think. Um, and, and we go through things and... You know, it's, it's, it's what he wants for the most part, but I like to, to just give advice. So, um, and my way is not always right. So we kind of go through it together and it would dive into and it's, it's fun. You know, it's, it's like teaching again. Well, that's, you weren't, you're an educator first and foremost. Kind of. And you came from. I tried. From, uh, I tried. Good job you came teachers from out a there. Teacher. You came from, your mom was a teacher. Yeah, that's why I never thought. So it's interesting because you still want to keep that education yeah, or, or knowledge. It's or definitely in there. It's Blood or happening. genes somewhere, somewhere yeah. in there, in my pocket maybe. But um, but yeah, I, I, I love watching um, people think and, and put, I think the biggest thing I like about having this platform is, is being able to to allow people to not be scared and to show themselves, because this is this is your this is your personality, this is your heart on a yeah. and you're gonna be judged by it. So and to, remembered by and it. remembered in good or bad. <laughs> but we wanna you know give them the opportunity without you know you know the least stressful environment. COVID really really messed a lot of people up. So we wanna mm -hmm. you know really focus on keeping people happy and and safe. And secure so it's a good good platform for me to give them give them a chance to grow so last but not least last one this so this one? is this is beef shin from maui so we're going all over the islands um on top of that and, and i did this so i like like i said i like cooking with nostalgic a little bit where you kind of think you know what it is kind of and maybe it's a little different but mm -hmm. um so it's got adobo flavors in it um and on top of that is smoked onion porridge 
So very hearty. That's good. Very, very hearty. Very good. What? So congratulations are in order because you're nominated for a James Beard Award. Yeah, that's the that's the whole team. Yeah, we did we did it together. And um, it's it's such an honor coming from Roy's and seeing his all the time. Mm -hmm. Um but yeah, to be in that class and hopefully hopefully we do good because I want you know I want them to have something that they're proud of too. So um, we're we're doing our best and cool. that's all we can do. Cheers to you. Cheers. And what are the hours here? So <clears throat> Wednesday through Sunday. Brunch is ten to two and nine to two on the weekends, and then five to nine on for dinner. So. For dinner, yeah. that's Monday, Tuesday is closed. Yeah, Monday and Tuesday closed. Wednesday through Sunday. Wednesday through Sunday, five yeah. to nine dinner. Yeah. Awesome. So make sure you make reservations ahead of time because he's always, always booked. Thank you for doing this. Show. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. This is thanks really for good. the support. Very, very good. Good job. Season 6 of Where Hawaii Eats is brought to you by the Honolulu Star Advertisers Dining Out, Cisco Hawaii, Outrigger Hotels and Resorts, Hawaii Cancer Care, Royal Lahaina Resort and Bungalows, and Waikiki's Premier Asian Food Hall, Sticks Asia.